Hey, good morning. This is Actor Shamarie. The uh, just wake up. Anyway, people, I'm kind of hoarse, but I'm um, trying to do what I need to do. All right, so you'll be getting more vlogs from me soon. This is actually Shamari. Yeah, man. Um, it's night now, so it's like um, here doing what I need to do, and thing and thing. But I have to know certain things still. You know? <laughs> Anyways, um, I'm here not really doing much today, but um, I'm just sitting here and just you know, holding a meds and thing and thing. Um. I haven't talked to anybody. I haven't, I haven't put out any vlog out there. I, I must apologize for that. I've been extremely busy. I have exams right now. So, yeah. I, I, yeah if you never know, I'm going to go to school. So, yeah, I'm going to go to school and I work. So, I have some things doing right now. I have some things doing right now. But, yeah, bedroom talk is coming back. You don't worry about it. Bedroom talk. I went put out more things on bedroom talk. And people might wonder why I use the name bedroom top because the setting is in my bedroom. Hello. <laughs> anyways, um, anyways, not only is that it, but um, you know, I, I love to see people, you know, just enjoy themselves and uh, see people add, you know, um, subscribe more subscribers and um, I like to see you guys just leave a comment on things that I need to talk about. If you want to get a tour of the theater just leave a comment and invite your friends to like the vlog and to subscribe also and also to share it all right because it's really and truly good and it's educated it's education free education being given all right so yeah with actor shama read here um if not only that you can like my vlogs also because if you if for instance you're an actor you're an upcoming actor and um you want to know where gigs are you know you can like my vlogs because i've been putting in gigs such as auditions here and there in jamaica you know for you to you know attend so just like my vlogs all right yeah like subscribe and everything well i'm in here it's like night and i'm having a it's not a split it's peanut yeah see there peanut it's peanut i buy it a while ago fifty dollars still but Kinda like it and thing every night my friend. Any every single night I have to have one. And uh, yeah. I'm just trying to open this thing here. One hand. <laughs> Alright. Just pack just one hand me using. Uh, kinda why well, that's something not open. Not only that, I get a peanut cake. Alright, so it's like fifty dollars, fifty Jamaican dollars. So I end up saying like a hundred Jamaican dollars for the two of them. My little dessert in the night, yeah, after my dinner, cause earlier I had a um, men cook. Yeah, I'm a man that can cook. Yeah, I can cook. So I like eat curry goat and chicken and I eat curry chicken tonight and white rice and yeah, I'm just having this as a dessert. Yeah, my dessert. Yeah, mm. fire, fire. Want some? <laughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. Roast nice, but you know, when I roast my peanut, them. I put a little fermento in it. Mm -hmm. Just good man. But when if I'm roasting peanuts or cashew, I put a little fermento in it and thing and thing and make it have this nice refined taste. But what I'm getting it's like roast peanut but it's kinda of have this smoke taste to it. Which which is a regular thing, but I would love if it have that because seasoning to it. I'm a Caribbean man, alright. I love my seasoning them. But it tastes good. 
it's not too salty and it's just really good so yeah you come on jamaica try it yeah if i'm which hopefully i'll be traveling soon i'm just saying you know this is just like after shamaril my thing you might wonder you know what may i look on i just look on um just watching a little video that's it um another vlogger <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah so i always sub I, i'm like you know i'm always supporting people so i support her um yeah future cold coldest tv yeah man future coldest tv me always a supporter yeah anyway back to me back to me back to me back to me yeah. anyways people i'm like you know i would love for you guys to subscribe to my vlogs you know um i want you to subscribe to support the jamaican vloggers you know support them you know and um yeah i'm just like to subscribe to support them but what do you um this morning I was reading the paper, um, online star. I don't know how true it is, but I was reading it and it was saying there's a headline there that it says that the um, the prime minister um, said that dancehall daggering songs contribute to a lot of the kidnapping and um, the heinous acts that have been carried out on women in Jamaica. Now, I see where people comment on it and say that um, he shouldn't say that and X, Y, Z. But this is my thing on it. I'm like, you know, um, dancehall will always be an escape goat. Dancehall is our culture. And you have individuals who really and truly don't understand dancehall. So therefore, they have it to say that dancehall is this bad thing, which dancehall is not no bad thing. It's something good. It's a way of where our people express themselves. All right. I don't hear anybody leaking out against Calypso or Soka, which those genres are very raw and raw than dancehall. And the, the movements is a lot of pelvic act pelvic movement and also dance our contains pelvic mo movement also but it, it's not so raunchy and raw and outrageous you know but um everybody has their own view but my take on it is that you can't hit dance all, mr prime minister you know dance all is not uh, something where it makes you want to do anything uh, we all have our own mind you know and he could we, we could have said about hip-hop because hip-hop is raw hip-hop talk about killing people and doing this and doing what not to women and xyz but dance is about enjoying himself and since year i rarely hear anything about uh, I rarely hear anything about the daggering songs, although you do have some male dancers who um, who are very talented who, and female dancers who are very talented and they use acrobat, acrobatic movements in their um, presentation. They are very artistic in their dancing. So therefore, I understand where I'm coming from to say yes. Um, because of these individual out there doing these artistic and these acrobatic movements in dance with women um it propels the men um to to, to kidnap our young girls and to do i'm really and truly to be honest i cannot agree with him i i, I can't agree with him i believe it's more from the, it, it, there's more towards that because if you look at uh, what happening to women now in Jamaica? It is not um. It is not dancehall. It is more of domestic, all right, domestic issues. Women and men not able to resolve their issues, so therefore they turn to violence. All right, there is a violent relationship. Man abusing woman, woman abusing man. And so happened that one going kill one and one going end up in jail. All right, one kill one and end up do a suicide. So more time is that happening. All right, so I love for individual or government to stop blaming 
or culture or music and saying that it's the music that our artists put out is um, getting these individuals, uh, you, you know, um, the, getting their brains or getting their mind corrupt and saying dance or corrupt the mind and make these individuals. So I'm like, you know, people, to be honest, take my word for it i don't believe dancehall has anything to do with this and if music had any sort of thing to do with it then i appeal and i ask my brethren and my sisters out there that are doing the music please this is from um this is from entertaining violence or this is from using violent lyrics and movement in your um uh, in, in your songs and in your videos, all right. So, if, if somebody cares, well, this is from doing that. But I still believe that dance doesn't contribute to it. Not saying that music doesn't contribute to certain things, and music isn't powerful, music is very powerful. But uh, we all have a mind of our own, and we know right from wrong, all right. So, we can't say. Um, is dance or make X Y Z or is Calypso make X Y Z or reggae? No, please. I, I think we need to find a way of uh, ending this monster, this man-made monster named crime in our country, than to blame it on another entity that is making strive for Jamaica. All right, let us. All be united. Let us love our brother. Let us be our brothers and sisters' keeper. All right. We are not Cain, and we are not Cain who kill Abel. All right. Let us love each other. That's all I'm asking. Just love and respect each other. If a man step on your shoes, you don't need for curse. All right. You can brush it off, and you live another day. All right. If you step on a virgin's shoes, turn around and say sorry. I bound somebody. Say sorry. All right, that's my take on it. If you are in a relationship that is very abusive, please leave. All right, no, 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 talk, no, ladies, stop talk. But if you not lick you, him not love you. Please, it no make no sense. A man will hit you, and for a man, don't make no woman lick you. And you sit down in a relationship and she talks some certain nasty things about you. You sit down in a relationship, leave. If you can do better and you know say you can do better, leave. And you can get better out there, leave and go and get better. Alright? Don't sit in there. Don't sit with it. Alright? That's my take on it, you know. And that's just me saying dance hall has nothing to do with what's taking place in Jamaica. You know, we said that Vibes Cartel um, is a great influence on our children. I don't think so. I believe these children have parents and their parents should be or should have that impact on their children the, the parents have the, their parents should stand out and should be in their life my mother my father stood in my, my side and their parental values have stood have, have stayed with me you know from ever since so as i said before Stop using dancehall as a escape quote. It's just not right. All right, it's just not right, and that's my few little thing. But I'm saying, just stop using dancehall. Anyway, people, this is my take on it, and this is my little thing, my little five cents. I'm just upset with you guys. Now bedroom talk tonight, and um, <clears throat> I'm just holding and hoping for better and greatness. So, people. Remember to like, subscribe, and share these vlogs. I'm just going to end this vlog right here. And um, that's it. Actor Shamarid, and I'm out. Mm -hmm.